alliance parties or whichever party is born now. But each and every citizen will feel, will see and taste the cake of being a Malawian. That is our job. <coughs> Presidents, ministers, parliamentarians, councillors, judges, magistrates, district commissioners, mayors, and all influential figureheads are captured because it's either their children, their businesses, or their properties were made by Indians. Who controls our tectonic plate in social life, economy, and our lives? We can't live like this. Our life was given to us by God. Nobody should control us. Mindset change. <clears throat> Therefore, to expect political will, judicial will, or legislative will to stop or shift the paradigm is a complete fallacy. This is why I appeal to you, each one of you, to be a movie of mindset change. Because we can only change the tectonic plate of our social, economic, and politics in Malawi if we change our mindset. Do not be surprised to see the same government contradicting itself. Anti-corruption Bureau Martha Gizuma obtains a warrant from the court to arrest the minister. And in the very same court, the judiciary comes and overrules the decision and the warrant of arrest. When you go to the government to say, what do you say? They say, we are on holiday. <laughs> Politics. Because they are place gunned they are hostage, they are chained by Indians. They don't have power. We need to change our mindset. We need to change our mindset and bring back our country into our hands. Movie, last movie number six. Malawi is castrated. You know what I mean, castrated? Sorry to say this, but it's obvious. The balls of Malawi are cut off by Indians, by Arabs, by those that come from outside. We don't have power. We need to bring back our powers by introducing speedy paradigm shift so that infertility of citizens on social and economic stance is reclaimed back into our hands. It all begins with you and me and everyone with mindset change. If we don't change our mind, <laughs> 